my channel. So today I'm coming to review a company that is actually coming up with products that are useful to both uh, people in the makeup industry as well as people that just love makeup in general. So the company is called Prime and Base. Prime and Base and they have a pretty neat idea. I have not seen anything like this until um, they reached out to me. Basically, they have come out with a palette that has both concealers and the setting powders all in one palette. And they have so many different shades for you to choose from. So the first layer here is actually the creamy concealers. You get actually 15 different uh, concealers to highlight and contour with. And so on this bottom row are actually the powders. I love the fact that it has these very, very dark, deeper shades. It is a very dark color okay very dark color there's a really bright yellow down here that probably won't pick up on camera I'm, I hope it doesn't come off white but it's a really bright yellow that you can actually use for foundations that are a little bit too red and you just want to cool it down a little bit I've tried that trick a couple times with the yellow powder and it actually works out pretty nice I just want to come and show you how creamy they are so I'm going to be using this um, yellow shade here and I'm just using a flat uh, Sedona Lace 941 brush. I'm just gonna apply this right underneath my eyes. I already kind of like have the same color underneath my eyes, but I just wanted to come and show you guys how creamy and brown skin appropriate this palette is. Just with that one pat, it's pretty much going a long way as you can see like I was able to get a lot of this applied and I'm just going to use my beauty blender to blend that out I just love that yellow glow that it's giving me. Really, really nice. I love like that golden yellowish highlight against brown skin. It is so pretty. So what do you guys think? Like. I think this highlighter or this palette pretty much passes. That color right there is just everything. Everything. So I'm now I'm going to find a shade from the powder side of the palette to set this with. All right, so now I'm going to set this with a powder from the other side. Now I can either go with the yellow shades here or the more, um, peach color shades. I'm gonna try this yellow powder and see how that works. So I'm just gonna get enough on my brush. That looks like a lot though. <laughs> that looks like a lot. And I'm just going to I'm not sure how this will work with um, bacon. <laughs> you guys, for those of you that like bacon, like, um, I know sometimes I like to bake too, but I'm not sure how to work with bacon. I haven't tried it with applying it underneath my eyes heavily and then letting it just sit there. I haven't tried that part yet, so. That looks pretty good. Now I'm going to go back in with these warmer uh, contour colors just to blend that back around my highlight. This is my uh, Taper Face Brush from Luxie. I'm just applying this. This is a good um, warm color to slightly contour with.
So I was able to show you a highlight, a contour, and also a bronzer slash blush. I'm also gonna show you the blush. This is my Luxie Large Angle Brush. We're gonna use that salmon color that I told you that I used for a blush before and just apply that on the apples of my cheekbones. So they also have like some shimmer colors in here. I'm gonna try the eggshell color in here for a highlight. And I'm using my taper highlighter from Luxie. This is the 522 brush. Now I didn't use this the first time. So this is the first time I'm actually trying that highlighter out. Not bad. So you guys let me know how you, what you think about this palette. They're very inexpensive, so I'm gonna put their information, of course, down below in the description bar, so you can go check out their uh, website, go check out their Instagram. They have a lot of pictures on their Instagram. That is my review. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this um, review slash mini tutorial. I'll see you guys in my next video. Stay flawless, boo. Bye.